Hi there, I'm Holly Chandler of the Julie Kinnear team. I hope you're doing well. As you probably heard, it's now recommended that we wear face coverings when in public. And since I'm not in public, I am at home like the rest of you. I'm going to take this off. If you'd like a list of places to go where you can find face masks, uh, check out BlogTO. They have a really good list. Toronto Life also has the list. Uh, it's more fashion leaning. There are a lot of independent designers in Toronto that are making masks. I got this at uh, Peach Berserk a couple of weeks ago. You can add to the list Studio Fresh. They're making some really beautiful masks and selling out quickly. If you'd like to make your own, if you sew, there are a ton of instructions online. And I keep hearing about people making tons of masks, um, giving them out to their family and friends, which is wonderful. You can also make a mask without sewing. So um, you just need a t-shirt, maybe a couple of uh, hair elastics, a bandana. And you can find these instructions, really clear instructions, on the CDC website. Um, so I've just heard that the, the fabric has to be thick enough that light doesn't come through. And one last thing is that sometimes I wear glasses and I was having such uh, a trouble, such trouble with um, uh, the glasses steaming up when I was wearing the mask. I was trying to figure out what to do, but I think we just have to wait for the weather to get better. So hopefully it gets warmer soon. Um, meanwhile, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and be safe.